Yes. Your colleagues will meet you at the boundary between Abaje and Obulotiti. From Obulotiti to the valley of Oandiago. Um, uh, you would go you would go with me that you decide. May the gods of our ancestors guide you. He say, say, say. Drop your weapons with your huh? people. You must appear helpless before the deities that surround Abanuri. What, what did you call her name? Where did you say you met this person from? Look, your protocols are too much. First is that you asked me to go on this deadly journey alone without the help of my friends. And now you want me to surrender my arms? What if the evil spirit decides to attack? How do I fight back? Your destiny lies in your head. The power in your bracelet is greater than your armor. Hurry now. Today is okay. The flute does not spring out on Ori. I'm a woman. Will he make it alone? Let fit the sound. Uh, 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 you are just realizing your hand. Yum, 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 yum. Give me your weapon. He whom his house is on fire does not just run. One of the miseries from Oke Buloye has gotten hold of Abono Relief of Longevity from Ohandiori. No! That is not possible. Okoma, we sent you on an assignment to visit the Queen Mother, to liaise with the forces of darkness, to wage war against those cowards from Oke Buloye. Why did you not carry out the assignment? My sisters, our Queen Mother went on a journey in search of a lover. We are losing our sisters consistently to the evil mortals. She would not say a word. She seeks to reproduce for more sisters. I want to go back today because she said she'll go and come back on the third half of day, which is today. Then we must consult a little bit of Queen Mother. <sighs> Finally, we are gradually conquering the daughters of Milinza Kingdom. Okay, Gunoye cannot wait to receive the brave warriors home. <laughs> Claiming success at these green circumstances is like a mirage in disguise. Ah. Where do we go from here? He who pays a piper the taste the tone. The daughters of Omirinza have double-crossed us. They have consulted the Queen Mother against us. Hey. We have to replan. Zimuzo, the gods are with you. Your sacrifices of appeasement is like royal ointment on their heads. Echewazo, mm? you will go with Chinwanumogo. Wherever his wisdom fails him, the sound of your music will salvage him. Remember everything Ibojoda told us. Abonma, please, can you go with them while I stay back and appease the gods and our forefathers for their safe return? Whenever you need me, I will be there. Now go! I can feel the coolness of the breeze from that direction. I think the river should be there. Let us go. The path from 
me. You are clean offspring of mortal. Your journey is full of evil. The bad if I strike you to death. Great one. Great one. Hmm? Great one. Please. Do not cast your spell and rot on me. That? Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, please. Do not cast your spell and rot on us. Oh, we are innocent, but we come in peace. Yes. Please, great one. Put us to test and ascertain our innocence. Please, we come in peace. I am Iyawanje. I am queen over Mirinza Kingdom. I'm queen over hills and valleys of Ahandago. What is your name? I am I am Eze Unyewani Monge. That is my name. I'm a descendant of Okibunoye. By the powers bestowed on me by the gods, I command you, Ezonyewa and Emwa, to be bound under their control. It's a pity you did not understand what I said before. I said my name is Eze Unyingwa Nimmo, which means that I am the king, lord, ruler, controller of the land that the spirits dwell. From this day onward, I relieve you of your powers and bind you under mine. You will do everything that I say. You will bend to my command. Now, by the power bestowed on me and ordinated by the gods of Okebunoye, I command you, right here and now, to ask your offspring, your daughters of Emirza, to flee from my kingdom. And from this day forth, they would have no business whatsoever for the people of Okebunoye. Yes! Yes! Name him Lord over you! Because his wisdom has suppressed yours. I name you Lord of Amirinza Kingdom. I name you Lord of the hills and valleys of Ahandago. I name your kingdom freeborn from the tenants of daughters of Mirinza Kingdom. Very well said. I can see how loyal you are. Now I command you. Bring forth the shimmering tears from your eyes. So that I can take it back to my kingdom. And conjure the gods of Okebunoye to grant my people freedom from the torment of Obanje of Mirinza. Of a man drives him to his destiny. The mentality of a man drives him to his destiny. 
the mentality of a man drives him to his destiny. Mama, I love Wansi, and I will marry him. I don't know what the problem is. The problem is not Wansi. It's about where he comes from. Mama, I know. I know they have a bad reputation. Yes, I know the seed of wickedness grows in their lineage. But Mama, once he has proven to me that he loves me. I don't want you to marry from his yabo. Look, according to tradition, a woman is not just married to her husband, but to the entire lineage, the whole kindred. But I love him, and I will marry him. Now, what about the man, Chinua, that you're betrothed to? Mama, please. Do you think I will sit here and wait for a man I don't know his whereabouts? Are you sure the gods have not unleashed their wrath on him for not coming to take care of his sick father? Whoever this Shinwa man is, is as good as dead. Don't say such things about a man that has not been condemned by the gods. Mama, whatever you and Papa collected from that man should be returned. Because I will not marry a man I have not met. What is this I heard about you? Having a relationship with a man from Isiabo. Father, I love Mwanzi. He means everything to me. Whoever this Shinwa is, he is dead. How can you say a thing like that about an innocent man like Shinwa? How can you? Since I was a child, I heard Mazi or Chudo has a son. Up to now, I have never set my eyes on him. My mates are getting married and you expect me to sit here and wait for him? Listen and listen, God. I am your father and it is part of my responsibilities to know what is good for you. That young man in question we are talking about here is the hero of this land. You are going to love him. <laughs> yes. Hero my foot. To me he's a coward. A strong man that cannot come back and take care of his aging sick father is a coward. Believe me, father, if I don't marry Wanze, I will kill myself. Oh, you will do no such thing. Onibu, you heard what your daughter said. I don't want to lose my daughter. You have to do something. Hey, hey, we calm down, woman. Nothing will happen to our daughter. I know that it's only a matter of time she will obey her father. But she's right in her argument. We're talking of a young man that cannot take care of his sick father. Besides, she, she has never met him. Now do you expect her to love someone she has not met? And who knows? Maybe the chief priest is not telling us the truth. Obim, how can you say a thing like that? But, but it, that's the truth. He probably doesn't want to drop the news that the young boy is dead because of what the news would do to his father. I know. I don't think so. Our chief priest is too big for that. Oh, he is the mediator between us and the gods. He cannot lie, else the gods will strike him dead. I, I don't know what to say. All I know is that I do not want to lose my child. You need to do something. How, how can she marry a man that, uh, that has been sent on an endless journey? It doesn't make sense. A woman, go back to the house and let me concentrate on what I'm thinking. Suit yourself. Yes.
It is time for the last and the most important item to be brought. We thank Chukuoku Abiyama. We thank the gods for bringing us this far. Aboma is supposed to be here. Yeah? Where, where could she be? We cannot continue to wait for her. We must proceed to the valley of Abokwe to get the water that flows through the fountain of justice into the cauldron of truth. Um, so, how do we now know the road? What our ancestors do not show us, no spirit scan. Is it lost that I sense in your voice, Echewozo? I wonder why you let your soul to be captivated by the beauty of a spirit maiden. Using your soul to the evil antics of a wolf in sheep clothing. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, please. Zimuzo, is it Aboma that you were talking about? Oh, yeah? She has been helpful all this while. Y yeah, yes, yeah, yes. You know you are blind. And you cannot see what I see. We rest here and continue in the morning. Ah, we rest here. Is it anyway she just says rest? Rest, 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 rest. Yeah? Zimuzo, my water god was stolen by one of the imposters at Obako. How do I get water from the cotton of truth? The gods will provide. Let us get there first.
My water guard. Hey, hey. Go, go, go. Go, go. go, 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 go. Hey. Not so fast. Mother fell. <laughs> I, Olak, would kill you. <laughs> you did not ask about me. My name is Chinalumoko, the only son of Ochudo. I have been named king over Mirza Kingdom. And over the hills and valley of Ohandiago, I have not come to fight you. Stay away, let me take my water guard. Never! I said, never! Let the Lord fight me and take his water guard, which was in my possession before he became a lord. Joseph, tell this little maiden to give way so that I can take my water guard. Let her go. Stay away, let me take my water guard! Barbarian here are not allowed to take water from the cauldron of truth that falls from the fountain of justice because they are unclean. Lies! About where she lies! We are as pure as snow! Not even the crafty is justified. He is an imposter. He was named the Lord of the Hills and the Valley because he lied with his name. Great gods of justice, your eyes cannot be tied on iniquity. A liar is not worthy to take water from the cauldron of truth. No, he is a messenger of the gods. A messenger that even Abokwe joined hands with Indiche for his destiny to be fulfilled. Abokwe, please let the destiny of your son be fulfilled. <laughs> he can't even speak for him. Abokwe! Abokwe! The God of Justice! My name is Tino Alumogo, son of Ochudo, Ikewelugo, as agreed by you. I beseech you this day that you allow my name prevail against the argument of the daughters of Mirza. And I ask you for power. Wisdom, understanding, to overthrow, to conquer against my enemies. Please, Abokwe, I have come to you as your son. Temper justice, mercy. Abokwe, Abokwe.
Aboma started this and we must finish it. We must finish it. Time has come for us to take what we have long envisaged. Chino Alumogo, son of Ochudo, a descendant of Okebunui, now has in his possession the things that we need. The three things that will put us in power over our sovereign empire. We will not hesitate to take it from him immediately. As we all know, he has been named Lord over Mirinsa Kingdom. And we can only get that from him by force. Yes, by force. We will get him and put him under our control by laying with him. He will be under our spell. When that is done, we will no longer be wandering in the forest of the spirits. We will have a kingdom of our own. We have to be. <laughs> His dreams will never come true. Never. Never. <laughs> Well done, friends. I know it went well. Uh, yes. <laughs> Thanks be to the gods. We will be returning to Okebuno immediately. Not so fast. I hope everything you need is complete. Yes, everything we need is here. We have the Agbanuri fluid. We have the shimmering tears of a mermaid. And we also have the water from the fountain of justice brought from the cordon of truth. Very good. Can I see them? Oh no, you can't see them. We do not have time. We need to hurry back to Kibunoye. Brothers, uh, let us go. But, 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 Zimu Zosu... Don't call my name. Have you forgotten what Ibojuda told us about your friendly friends in the evil forest? Aboma here is not an exception. Um, 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 Zimu Zosu, what are you talking about? Uh, Aboma, what? Chinua, my name is Zimu Zosu, which means show me the way. The three wonderful items we have are the same items that makes her a fugitive in the land of the spirit. She needs them to be readmitted to Mirinza kingdom. Hmm? Enough of all this blasphemy! Hmm. Son of a Chudo, I command you to give me those things now! Hmm. This is my territory. I am the masquerade that comes out during the scarcity of masquerades. Do not dare my patience! Ah! I am not afraid of you. Simuzo, the daughter of Ibojuda, did not come into the evil forest unprepared. I am the beakless vulture that perforates the stomach of a corpse. Depart from here. Yes. I can see you've got this. Ah! Ah! Ah!
You have been named Lord over Mirinza Kingdom. When will you start using your wisdom? Chinua, the bag. The bag! Chinua, check the bag. I want to be at Okebunoye now. I want to be at Okebunoye now! We have to leave now. We must not allow our mama and her cohort to overthrow us. If we cannot be in charge of our own kingdom, then we must not allow our mama to victimize us and make us slaves in our own kingdom. Dagger was very poisonous. Very, very poisonous dagger. But he will be fine very soon. on the annals of this kingdom. Now I can dine with my ancestors. I cannot talk about that. Nothing will happen to you. You will live. Baba, you will live. Baba! 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 My son, I know you are grieved because of the earthly departure of your father. But it is a debt owed by everyone to be paid by everyone at one time or the other. The rich and the poor join hands in the loin cloth of death. The birds, the birds will soon stop chirping because its age has been darkened by pain. <sighs> our land no longer regard and respect our strength and effort because 
Its source of facility has also been darkened. The joy of our land has been seduced by this camouflage lead. Ogbanje's spirits have exploited our common wish. <laughs> this virgin our land! Exchange our beloved attributes for mere cowries. They came to our land and met us unarmed. But they also came sophisticatedly armed with obscure mysteries. They took away the love. Our love! Our peace! Our oneness! Our togetherness! What did they give us? What did they inflate us with? Pain. Sorrows. And above all, death! 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 <sighs> Thank the gods for giving us victory. For my father's death will be the last untimely death record ever. No cable no yeah. The rain and terror for Banje is over. They will never torment this land ever again. Oh, Oh, Judas dead, my, my father's dead. <laughs> it's the last sacrifice. On how to bury our fallen hero. Hi! 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 Where is Nayoni? He went out, but he's fine. Ma, greet our visitor. Hey, yes, Hmm. Is she all right? She is fine. She's just a child. But not to worry, I will talk to her. Hmm. Does she know she is betrothed to me? Of course she does. Do not worry. When the time comes, everything will take effect. Um, <laughs> I, I brought you bush meat. Oh, thank you. Uh, yeah. Um, I want you to use it to prepare a very special oh. meal for yourself, Naomi, and my wife to be. This feels heavy. <laughs> Anything for you, Antelope or grass cut? <laughs> Mama, cook first. Very good spirit. Thank you.
drink. Drink! of the sanctification process. We turn the course one more time for a successful completion of this day. You will henceforth become forever young and free from the manipulation. Do you believe that Obira Nama, the daughter of Onuibo, has been difficult towards me? She does not love me. Are you serious? This is ridiculous. Have you told Ibo Joda about it? How could you say a thing like that? That's not possible. Why on earth do you think that I would tell him that? End of war marks the beginning of another war. Believe me, Chinwale Mogo, if you will use your head, she will not be a hard nut to crack. Is she not a woman? She's coming. Um, uh, like I told you, you have, you have the best goal. You have, you have the best goal. waiting for you here since. I'm sorry. It's my mother. She was sending me on errand. 
I had to do a lot of them before I could come to see you. You know I will have to spend a lot of time with you. I can see. I can see you're getting too attached to your mother. You are supposed to love me more than them. But it seems they are taking much of your time. Listen. Yes. I can't deny the fact that I love my parents so much. But I can't love them more than you. Yes. Took a smile. <laughs> now let's go and fetch water. Come, let's go. <laughs> Don't do it. I will. <laughs> Don't do it's it. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Did you hear that? Apparently, they are sisters from the underworld. Hi! <laughs> that girl is beautiful. You like her? You know, I love her. She is too beautiful. Hi! Did you see that ship? He went in the Let us go with her. Let us wait here. What can we do for you? Point of correction. The question should be, what can I do for myself? Hi! Beautiful maiden. You are too beautiful. Eh? That's what they call That's That is what you are. <laughs> Please, don't be in a hurry to move. Oh, There's something I want to tell you. Uh, my name is H. Ozo. Oberina Maye is from my village. <laughs> so, what can I do for you? Let me start from helping you carry your water. <laughs> Put it on my head. Hey! <laughs> What do you want? I, I just want to help you carry your water. Please. Let me help you carry your water, please. Please. Please, let me help you carry your water, please. My daughter, gone are the days when my heart was still young and strong. The transition of night that envelops the day has made my youthfulness fizzle away. I know that very soon I'll be joining my ancestors because I hear their gentle voices calling me home. Yes. Papa, you cast fear into me whenever you talk like this. I want to have my own grandchildren. When are you going to get married? But Papa, you bluntly refuse me to marry Wanzi. 
the man I loved. You even threatened to kill him anytime he set his feet into your compound. Listen to me. When a man gets wealth, popularity and power, there is only one more thing that he needs. What is that? That is joy. Money, wealth cannot buy joy. My joy as a father is in my grandchildren. You are instigating I get married to a man called Chinua. I don't love him. If you love me as a father, marry Chinua. This is my last wish. I made a promise to his father, my friend. I have carefully told you that I will get married when I find a lover. I will never marry him. Never. I'll read my lips. If you don't marry that innocent young man, I swear, I will never forgive you, even in my grave. I love everything about you. But the most one that is killing me is your size. And you know what? You look so I can fit because I can just. Please don't. Don't. Leave us. Didn't you hear me? I said, leave us. What do you do? Go. Go. I, I will see you in the ring. Yes, I can even come to your house. I'll come to your house. Oh, you come to my house. Yes. Hey, Chevo. Hey. Hey, can you come? I'll be the wrong one. I'll come. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. Both of you are getting along very well. Yes. Um. That man is very funny. He is an enemy. Um, Obi, why is your face like this? I Me, mean, you don't look happy. My father is threatening Brimstone and Tonda if I refuse to marry Chinua. Hmm. I don't know what to do. That is your fate. Eche was proposed to me, and I've accepted to marry him. But I'm just waiting for you to get married first and return to marrying Za. I cannot marry Chinua. He has gotten the three wonderful powers to stop me from getting back to marrying Za kingdom. He has not taken your wisdom. How do you mean? Accept his proposal. Get married to him and get pregnant. I will fix a day with Echewazo for my marriage ceremony. Echewazo cannot come to my village on such an occasion without his bosom friend. Yes, that is true. You have the powers to make your unborn child due for delivery. When he might have gotten to Eziabo with Echewazo, I will die. When he drinks from the cup of wine, I will give to him as a seal of our marriage. I will die. I will also join you so that we can journey back to Mirinza Kingdom. Are you sure it will work that way? Yes. He only knows that you will die on the day of your delivery. But he doesn't know when. Neither does he know that we share the same destiny. You can't be too sure. <laughs> Accept his proposal. But you have to use wisdom in dealing with him. We have to be careful in dealing with those men. Remember, they are no longer ordinary men. Relax. Very soon, we will get back to me residence. But you have to do the right thing while I do. <laughs> we 
Helped you to cut all this. Who else but Shinwa? Shinwa. You told me the other day that he helped you to fetch water. And now he's helping you with the firewood. He's a good man. Mm. Indeed. But Mama, I think he's up to something. He loves you. And he wants to marry you. Why don't you just accept? Mama, please, I'm hungry. Can I have something to eat? Yes. You can have something to eat. But after eating, I need you to fetch me water. We've run out of drinking water. I said after eating. Okay, Mama, I will. <laughs> Let's take this inside. Mm. <coughs> I'm sorry. No. Sorry. No. <coughs> sorry. Oh. No. You will get well soon. Oh. Eche. Hmm? Eche. Huh? Eche, can you believe that Obiaranama hasn't come to visit me yet? Hi. Knowing fully well that. <coughs> <coughs> Knowing fully well that she is the reason for my condition. See, the best thing you will do for yourself is to forget about her for now. Do it well first. Now. Chinua, am I not here to take care of you? Oh. Huh? Stop lamenting and get well first. Yes, get well first. Get well. Oh. Yes, she was supposed to come take care of him, but we did not. So she came to do what we were supposed to do. Well, please, do not mind him. Eh? Please. She is a gifted healer, just like her father. She only came to know how I am faring, that's all. That's all. It's all right. My mother asked me to give you this food. Ah! Was she always being your mother? Eh? So if you are not on an errand for your mother, you will not visit someone that nearly lost his life when he was trying to save yours. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you for rescuing my life the other day. Do not mention. Do not mention. I will give my, I will give my life for yours over and over again. I love you. I love you. It doesn't matter. I love you. I love you. Stay with me. Do you really love me that much? The last drop of my blood. I will give my life for yours. Bobby, you're all I want to live for. I love you. I love you. Please. Hey. Stay with me. I love you too. I can't thank the gods enough. Finally, we are here as man and wife. Okay. I love you so much. Your love enveloped my heart. That all I think about is you. I thank you for allowing me the chance to prove to you how much I love you. Take me inside and make me feel like a woman. What are we waiting for? What are you saying? What are you saying? Please, my husband. I wish to go with you. But my condition is not favorable at this point. <coughs> this is my seventh month. My love, how do I explain to your best friend that you, you of all people could not make it to her traditional marriage ceremony? I mean, how do you think she would feel? I'm sure she will understand. I really wish to go with you, but my condition will not allow me. Are you sure you're all right? Are you sure? Because I don't want anything to happen to you. Look, I can forfeit that ceremony and just no, stay no, with you. No, please. Go. I will see her when she returns to H. E. Wazo's house. Are you sure you're all right? All right, um, in that case, you should go to your parents' house so that they can take very good care of you. I will do that immediately. you leave. My daughter. Yes. Yes, father. I want you to take this drink oh. and give it to that man who is about to become your husband. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, father. Daddy. <laughs> 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 Hey boy, hey boy, come here. Yeah. 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 for you. Hey boy, yes. Yes. Where is it? I'm back there. You have to call out to me. Hey, is that back. You have to go back. I'm coming, I'm coming. Is that... Oh, my God. 
Not join you at Easy Abo. Even the girl it was who wanted to marry died this afternoon. Hmm. Immediately after he drank the pure wine. Hey! Everyone We have accomplished our mission in the land of the mountains. We will now go back to Mire in the kingdom where we belong. How happy our sisters will be to have us back. I can't wait to get to Mire in the kingdom. It is a serenity, an association of divinity. We are... We have not seen him. What happened? No, no. Eh? You left Eziabo, kept everybody waiting. Where is Oberanama? Well, this is the reason I left Ozulongye's compound. I got the news that my daughter died while giving birth to this baby. What? To fear what?
An old woman had the plants of eating some in the leaves, not knowing that the same in the leaves equally had plans of purging her afterwards. Chinalumogu. Chinalumogu has fulfilled the prophecies of eradicating the mischievous operation of the evil spirits. The spirits of the Banjo daughters from the valley of Santiago. The gods decree that Chinalumogu will save this kingdom. And the gods, in their benevolence as well, decided to use him in saving a Zabo. And the gods have rewarded you with a child. What name shall be given to this child? His name is Wajudo. Finally, peace has returned to our kingdom. And the Ogbanje spirit of Mirza will no longer torment us. By the power vested in me, as the mouthpiece of the gods of this kingdom, and the, the custodian of tradition, I have a name. Of the beginning of your life in the land of the living marks the end of the torment of the spirits of Obanji. I'll get you